Hey guys, welcome to the video today. In today's video, I'm going to go through some troubleshooting steps if your Artec Bluetooth keyboard is not working. The model number on this one is HB030B. But before we begin, I wanted to let you know that I do have other videos on this Artec Bluetooth keyboard that I'll link at the end of this video. And if you're interested in have time, please check those videos out. Okay, so here's the first thing that I'm going to show you. The on-off switch is currently in the off position, and I'm going to turn this to the on position, and the power light turns on, and then the power light turns off. If your power light did not turn on, it may mean that the battery is low or all the way drained, and you need to try to charge your keyboard. And to charge the keyboard, we are going to turn the keyboard off. So we're going to turn the on off switch to the off position. And then this is the cable that came with the keyboard. And this side has a micro USB and this side has USB. So we're going to take the micro USB and on this side of the keyboard, here is where that plugs in. And when you plug this in, you just wanna make sure that you plug it in the correct direction. So I'm going to do that now. And you also wanna make sure that it plugs all the way in like so. Um, make sure that it's all the way connected securely. Okay, so here is a USB port on my laptop, and then I've taken the twist tie off of this cable so it can reach properly. And when you plug this in, you wanna make sure that you plug it in the correct direction and that it's secured all the way into place. And then the charge light on the keyboard will turn red while it's charging, and when it's fully charged, it will turn green. All right, guys, so the next thing that I'm going to show you is if the backlight on your keyboard is not working when the keyboard is turned on. It may be that the backlight is just turned off and I'm going to show you something that you can try. So let's turn the keyboard on and the backlight color on this keyboard is currently set to the enhanced version of this color. And you can change the backlight to the regular version of the color, the enhanced version of the color, or having the backlight turned off. And to do that, I'm going to press the function and this alt button at the same time and then let up and the backlight turns off. And then if we do that again, it will go to the regular version of this color. And if we do that again, it will go back to the enhanced version of this color. Okay, so the next thing that I'm going to talk about is if your keyboard turns on but is not working with a device that it's paired to, try bringing that device closer to the keyboard to make sure that it's within range. And if that doesn't work, you can try unpairing the keyboard from that device and any other device that it might be paired to and try to go through the pairing process again. And to go through the pairing process, you're going to make sure that the keyboard is on, this keyboard is already on, and then you're going to press the connect button and the light above status should start blinking blue and the keyboard should show up as Bluetooth 3.0 keyboard in available devices on the device that you're trying to pair it to. And once you select Bluetooth 3.0 keyboard and pair the keyboard with the device that you're trying to pair it to, the status light will turn off. And then you need to let the keyboard know what type of device that it's paired to. So for iOS, you can press function and Q at the same time and then let up. For Android, you can press function and W at the same time and then let up. And then for Windows, you can press function and E at the same time and then let up. And when you're all done using the keyboard, just make sure to turn it off to save battery power. All right, guys, and if none of these troubleshooting steps have helped, the other thing that you can try is to reach out to Artec to see if they have any additional troubleshooting steps. I hope this video has been helpful and thank you so much for watching. And like I said earlier, I do have other videos on this Artec Bluetooth keyboard that I will link at the end of this video. And if you're interested in have time, please check those videos out. Thank you again so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment, and if you have the time, check out these other great videos.